always you have to ask yourself, what is the why? What is the why you are doing anything you are doing? Because if you don't have the why, the purpose, why you are waking up to go to your job, why you are waking up to your dream every day, because they're going to, you're going to have some times when you're going to feel like you want to quit. You want to feel like, you know what, I've had enough. I've had enough. I want to quit. But when you have your why, then you are like, you know what, I'm just going to push it. I'm going to push it. And and this is especially for young people. Young people don't have the resiliency. They don't, they, they don't have the, the tenacity that it takes to fight for their dreams. They see Instagram, they look at Facebook, people are, you know, uh, getting likes and becoming stars and, and everything. But they don't know that sometimes what you see on Instagram or what you see on Facebook is not reality. Most people have succeeded in everything they do. All these strong people you see, the Oprah Winfrey, the, 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 the Ellen DeGeneres, all these people. They have worked hard every single day. Steve Harvey, they will tell you. Tyra Perry, they will tell you. Diamond Platinum from Tanzania, they will tell you. Eric Omondi, they will tell you. They have worked hard. You look at, at them, some of them musicians, they stay, take time to stay in the, in the studio for eight hours hours straight hours i remember one time beyonce was saying that she was doing a i think she was doing a a, a video or something and then she was doing a movie and a video at the same time she she didn't even remember when she ate well you know when you see the glamour when you see when she's uh you know recording or when you see when she's doing her tours and on and she's on the red carpet that is what you see but you don't know the hours people put the hours. And, and if our young people can take one thing from me, is that you have to be persistent, consistent, and persistent, and disciplined. Oh my goodness, discipline. Even when you feel like you don't have to wake up, you wake up. When you're building your business, when you're building your empire, you, don't, you can't sleep. You have to wake up. You have to keep pushing. And let me tell you something. Every person has challenges in life. Every single person. People come on television or people come on social media. They smile, they laugh, but you don't know their other personal life. So you cry, so what? It's not going to change. It is my friend. <laughs> it's not here, but my friend. Vin Norman Vincent Paul, who said that when you have bigger challenges is when you even need to work harder because God gives you bigger challenges and he's challenging you to see how hard you work because he's going to see you through it. There is nothing, there's no challenge that God can see you through. God wants to see you that you trust him, but you also have to work hard. God is not going to give you anything on a silver platter. You have to work hard. You have to put your time. And lastly, for the young people, look at your surrounding. Who are your friends? Who are your five friends? Tell me your five friends and I'll tell you who you are. So be careful. Who are your friends? And also look for mentors. People who mentor you. You don't have to have a mentor who you see. You can have a mentor, somebody you see. People like Steve Harvey, people like Oprah Winfrey, people who have succeeded. See what they do. Success leaves clue. And keep fighting. Keep fighting. So as you ask yourself, why? You have to grind. Keep grinding. Keep grinding every single day. And as you go, take yourself with people who are the same mind as you, who you talk the same 
language. There are people you will tell your dream and they kill it immediately. You tell them, maybe like, oh my God, people have never, how are you going to do that? How are you going to do that? I will do it because other people have done it. Why not me? Why somebody else? It doesn't matter whether you have education or you don't have education. Because most successful people don't even have a college education. So don't tell me that, that I don't have education or those people have degrees. No. They, most people are, have seen who are successful. Oprah doesn't have a college degree. Uh, Les Brown doesn't have a college degree. Um, all these people. Steve Harvey. Oh, I talked about Steve Harvey. What's his name? Steve Jobs. Never had a college degree. He was making his first computer in his garage. Do you hear me, people? In his garage. Some of you are so lucky. You have homes, you have places where you can do things, but you have to blame everybody. The government is not going to come to give you nothing. You can blame the government. You can blame uh, because you're black, because you're, I don't know what, you're a woman. It doesn't matter. You can blame if you look around to blame somebody, you will find somebody or something to blame. So that is given. So it is about time you take responsibility. You start working towards your dream. Work with people, work with you. Find mentors who can work with you. And you will realize your dreams. Thank you, Dr. Palm. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll see you in another episode. Thank you.